Tyson Fury out there, man. God damn it. I can't believe we're going to still talk about this guy every time he mentions anything. But Tyson Fury uh, claiming they've reached a, quote, massive offer, or they received, sorry, a massive offer for the Deontay Wilder rematch to take place in Saudi Arabia. <laughs> he said his team will consider this proposal, but as things stand, the fight is scheduled for February 22nd at the T-Mobile Arena in Las Vegas per IFL. <sighs> Gary, is this just trolling? I mean, I think there was probably a legitimate offer from Saudi Arabia for this fight because Tyson Fury was in the country. Uh, with WWE, I would not be surprised if there was a conversation that was, that took place. I don't think it happens, though, right? I, I, I'm hoping it doesn't happen either. I, I'm saying I don't know how big the WWE event did. Um, I, I think like they talked to him about fighting there. I, I don't know. If, like, j- just, for, uh, just for the record, after that event, the, uh, the Saudi Arabia government re-upped their deal and uh, actually expanded their deal with the WWE, so... It was good so for them. I'm, I'm saying that a pending offer, like let's see how this other fight does, this Joshua fight does, and then I want to reconnect with you about bringing another fight here. Now, does it actually happen? That's going to depend on two things. The backlash after the fight, if mostly people don't care, oh, it for could the, happen. for the AJ Ruiz fight, you mean? Yeah. Yes, yeah. Yeah. Right. If mostly people, you know, whatever. Yeah, the ratings the, and the, everything. By the time we get to Saturday, does the, the rhetoric of, hey, this was a bad move, guys, does that go away? That could absolutely make a, a factor of more fights going there. You're absolutely right. The second thing is how big is the bag? Those are the two things that are, you know, is it economically feasible? Does it make economic sense for me to do this? How much am I going to lose by putting it in Saudi Arabia? How much am I going to gain mm-hmm. from Saudi Arabia paying me? If this one is more than this one, I'm going to put the fight there. I mean, like, it's not a publicly traded company, so their obligations aren't to the shareholders, but it, it's still the profit model. Right? They still want to make money. So mm. if, if they see it as a gain, yeah, they may lose some fans, but they're going to make that up by getting oh, a much bigger it's, bag. It's capitalism 101. Like, I'm going to make more money over here, but over here there's like human rights violations and massive issues and like genocide happening. Oh well, I'm making more money over there. Like I'm, that's where I'm going to go. Right. The only reason, the only way they wouldn't put it there is if there was so much backlash that they, that 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 gain didn't offset the loss. Which I doubt most, that happens. Yeah, most really people don't it. really care, so they'll just put it over there. Yeah, I mean, God, companies got companies got to work with like Nazi Germany during World War II. Like <laughs> people rarely care about this shit, unfortunately. Um, but moving on, I I do think in a way this is trolling from Fury because I think he just loves putting things out there in the media. But I do think there's a legitimate sense that Saudi Arabia wants more fight, more sports from the U.S., from Western um, countries overall in that in Saudi Arabia. So, therefore, they're going to give them the bag. If the rumor that we talked about uh, maybe a week or so ago about the $75 million purse that either AJ received or the fight received, AJ, AJ Ruiz, and David Bixen Span, a formerly dead spin uh Journalist, uh, no longer there, obviously, since everyone quit from Deadspin. Uh, he reported that that number is feasible since they're giving around the same figure for the WWE. And so, I don't know, man. To your question of what what's the money going to be? What's the bag they're going to offer to a Wilder Fury fight? I think it would be high. Uh, and that might, that might take really good fights that should belong maybe in the U.S. or U.K. to Saudi Arabia for no reason. Other than money and capitalism. 